Yo, what's up, everybody? This is Filipino Baller Four with my first commentary for my first for a Left 4 Dead 2 survival video. And so I was. This isn't really my first one that I've actually done, because I actually did um, another one for an AK-47 video on MW2, but for some reason it couldn't get processed through YouTube and go and have enough sex appeal to make it to the live internet. So yeah, this is so me and my friend Ponchi Schmoopy we're playing survival on bus depot in the parish and I'm using what looks like a scar scar H plus an M16 and with the Molotov, adrenaline, a med kit and the flashlight with backup pistols. And so yeah, I really and then this charger tries to go for me, but I just walk by it. Walk like walk two steps to my left. So that it'll only get nicked instead of me. And there's our first tank. And yeah, so I ninja it right there. And then in what time ninja it, it dies like automatically. Because it can't appeal to me. So yeah. And I really think this is like the easiest place on bus depot to survive. Because you see, you can set up some gas tanks over there, like in front of you. When you look behind you, um, there's a fence protecting you. So that you can't get hit that much from the back unless they come from the rooftop. And see, there's an ammo pack right there for unlimited ammo. Just in case you like feel like you need to get more like me. Whenever I like done shooting my gun, I'm going to always reload. And because like, I feel that like sometimes in Left 4 Dead 2, I like some for some reason get attacked by random zombies that come out of nowhere. So I feel that I need that whole ammo pack just see right there see if I'm not doing anything I'll just reload and see there's a good example of, of the fence see they're gonna go over the bathroom instead of going over a fence so that's the one good way to survive in the bus depot and if you want to know some other ways just comment and then maybe I'll put another video of me surviving in a different spot of bus depot yeah, so I get jockeyed and I try to make a run for it, but then I decided to come back and protect my companions because the tank died, so I wasn't scared anymore. And I hear a smoker somewhere, so I'm panicking because smokers are really think something that I really don't like. Well, actually, most special infected, I don't really I like them, but when you get attacked by them, you're it's practically useless, like a charger right there. If that thing got me through a fence somehow, like magically teleported, Reloading. I would have been stuck right there getting pummeled, getting smashed into the ground. I would, might have even died or Reloading. been encapped. So yeah, that's how I roll. So see, I got more ammo. So and it doesn't, and it doesn't disappear. So I think that's something that they should that um, Left 4 Dead should do, like fix that if you get too much ammo. You should like it should disappear. So here, I take a rock for my friend Ponchi because, because um, usually um, tanks would always go for Ponchi Schmoopy. Because so like if we're like standing next to each other, um, tanks are pretty racist against Asians, so they would go for me, go for Ponchi instead of me, because I'm Filipino and I don't really think I'm that Asian. So if you think that Filipinos are Asian, then just tell me and then I'll say that the tanks are racist to Vietnamese instead. So yeah, so I don't know how that got set on fire, but I just ignore it and I make a run for the medkits over here. Then like right when I got my medkit, my friend Ponchi Shmoopy tells me that there's a medkit over there and I think he's lying. So I go over there and check just in case and then I actually see that there is a medkit and a DKB unit. So I feel like a retard. And I think that maybe next time me and Ponchi can survive just a bit longer if I didn't go that way. And there's one of those zombies I really hate. Those armored zombies that you have to hit so they fall on the ground. And so they turn around because their only weak spot is the back. So yeah. And here com I think here comes another one of those bastards. Oh yeah, right there. So you have to hit them and then like just pummel them with scars hoping they die. And I take some ammo. And I see fire, and I'm pretty confused right now, and I don't even know how that happened. And then I saw a rock slide, so I know that the tanks come from behind us, so I just bring hell to it and start spraying my my buttocks off. And I see a flying hunter, and it gets Ellis, and I try my best to save him. So I just 
bring hell to that hunter too. And there's a tank. It's coming after me and Ponchi, but then I luckily get hit by it. And then it continues to go for Ponchi. See, that's what, see, they are, it is racist to Vietnamese people. But that tank just went, and it's still pummeling him. So I can just go behind it and destroy it. And then I just revive Ponchi Shmoopy so that we can continue this survival of the fittest. Because, except for me, see, that's a, I don't really like that. The fact that friendly fire is on. So here we see that I'm about to beat my world record with well, 533 and so yeah and there's a charger and he somehow is on too many drugs so he faints out of nowhere and then there's some ass there's some spitter goo so I go in the corner hoping that nothing goes for me and then I see a tank so I'm starting to get scared so and then ass and then I see two tanks so this part I get really scared so we're gonna be punchy score too so I take Oh, see, right when I'm gonna take my adrenaline, it like throws a rock at me magically, and then we don't, I don't, I get hit by it, so I couldn't make a run for it. And then we notice here that my other friend, Castle Zombie, who I've been friends with since like I think kindergarten, just joins the game and joins as Ellis, who is in caps over there. So I try my best to protect him, but there's no point because Ponchi is like running over there. And then, so we see Ponchi. So he actually gets to me this time. See, he has adrenaline on so he can get me up. So then I take my adrenaline and get my friend Castle Zombie up. Uh, at first, I want to heal myself. Then I go get him up. Or Ponchi gets him up, I guess. So we see that he's having a hard time because he's, he's down with health. But, you know, we can still survive. And then, yeah, so we see that there's another tank right there. And I see another tank to my right, so... I know we're screwed, and so yeah, this is really where me and my friends get pummeled to death, and so yeah, well, see you guys, it's our world record, 708, there you guys, just keep up, subscribe, comment, yeah.